Welcome back as we all work to rebound from the pandemic. Some good news this week for gyms and fitness centers. Governor Polis has asked the state health department to lower the COVID dial from level red to orange, meaning larger capacity limits can begin on Monday. Let's rejoin Andy Cohen again live this afternoon, hearing from personal trainers at one Colorado Springs gym about the change and this positive news here, Andy. It certainly is, Robin. It couldn't come at a better time because New Year's in the month of January, typically some of the busiest times of the year for gyms and fitness centers, as many people are making those resolutions to stay in better health in 2021. It's been almost five weeks since fitness centers in El Paso County had to lower their capacity to 10% under level red COVID restrictions. Lifetime Fitness members said in a recent survey that COVID restrictions have personally meant a change for the worse. We found that a lot of people working from home have gotten more sedentary and they've lost their motivation to come in to the gym to work out. Staying active isn't just good for your body, it's also good for your mind. It's a big thing because you're releasing endorphins when you're exercising, you have community here. In this club, you have this beautiful natural light that hits you. Even with restrictions easing up, they're still taking many COVID precautions. Members must have their temperature checked as they walked in. Masks are mandatory. Barriers separate workout areas and group classes are smaller, require reservations, and are held in a larger space. We're hoping that we'll still get people to come in. Maybe they'll be a little less afraid seeing the you know extent that we've gone to to try to keep them safe and knowing that Exercise does boost the immune system. Sticking to New Year's resolutions takes accountability. So Lifetime has changed up its annual commitment day so that members can keep those promises to themselves, whether visiting the gym or working out at home. This year we are going more virtual, so the members do have the option to choose like a movement program, a virtual 5K, uh, cycling, you know, get so many miles in in the month. And they're having to go in and hold themselves accountable by logging these exercises. She also points out that regular exercise is beneficial for keeping a healthy immune system, which is essential if you should ever encounter anyone with COVID-19. Always watching out for you, El Paso County. Andy Cohen, News 5.